gonna try something different today so the past few days I've done this thing where I try and warm up by doing shader programming for anyone that doesn't know shader programming is really complicated and like there's tons of math in it. I don't know what I've been thinking like why have I been doing the most complicated programming in the morning so you know I'm flipping this around I'm doing the easiest stuff in the morning and that's gaming I'm gonna, I'm gonna play some Borderlands so, I think this will actually work better. We're going to see, though. Anyone who's watched my stream before knows I love Borderlands. So, let's get right into this. So we were playing Axton before, I think I'm like level 13 maybe, I just got through Bloodshot Stronghold, we're kind of at a turning point in the story, um, we just saved a guy but bigger stuff is going to happen, so yeah I'm level 13, this is my first time really playing Axton. So let's go hand in this quest.
destroyed a Hyperion supply train, got a priceless piece of technology, and befriended an insane homicidal 13-year-old. Best, get back to Sanctuary and unwind. A new power core? Whoa, that looks like it could keep our shields up for months. Years, even. Nice, and I got a relic. Using Hyperion tech. That core you brought us earlier is nearly burnt up. Why don't you pop it out? Shove in that new core you found harder than a shiv into a truck's against sternum. Sorry, old Crimson Land saying. That's racist. Okay, I think we're in biz. What the hell? Hey, you know, I think it's finally time to tell you that little secret. Angels working. Um. Lowering sanctuary's shields, Jack. Jesus Christ. Shift. What a bitch. That's not a power core. Oh fuck. Oh nice fuck. Done, Holy yeah. shit. Let's kill ourselves. Wait. What the hell did Lieutenant Davis? She is down, Rowland! Oh man, somebody start getting Where did Lieutenant ground? Davis go? Jesus Christ. I've got a really bad idea. Scooter, get sanctuary in the air. Roland, get me some iridium. Pretty sure we can't do that without killing, I don't know, everyone in the city. Ready to fly, Lily. You got your Holy Boom. fuck, that citizen just got splattered. I just watched someone turn into red mist. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit, one just landed right on me. No, no, they can't stay here forever. Somewhere. Somewhere is better than here. What are you doing, Lilith? Whoa. Teleported. Find Roland. Oh shit, Roland. Oh shit. But Roland. Roland, shit. Oh my god. Here, here, here. What are you gonna do, Lilith? I've never used this much. You might wanna hang on. Never used this much? What do I hang on to? Um that was an accident. I'll see you on the other side though, I promise. Hit it, Scooter! Oh shit. Oh my god. That's badass. That's the best you got. A flying city? What did you jumps possibly have that makes you think you've got a chance against me? A siren. Sup. Huh. Holy shit. So I know you're angry at me, right? Fucking now, betrayed us. I'll explain everything. Just get to the fridge. It's the only way to reach the highlands. I detect Lilith might have phased your city there. She's fucking creepy, man. It's like staring at me. She watches me poo. Scooter does that too, but I mean like Scooter will buds. Get red. I love the way you vault hunters just up and trusted Angel. <laughs> Never occurred to you that she was working for me, did it? 
I did the same thing to the last four Vault Hunters, but I'll, I'll be entirely honest. Tricking you guys this time? <laughs> Way funnier. The fridge. Hey, thanks for taking the bait and grabbing that power core. It was hard to concentrate on charging the Vault Key, what with Roland's buddies attacking my Iridium mines. Yeah, yeah, I got you baited. I know. You'll be able to reconnect with your friends after you get through the fridge. What's with the fridge? Take that! Is it literally a big fridge? Sanctuary has disappeared. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not friends anymore. Son of a witch. The door's iced over. Let me help you with that. Ooh, money. Circle of slaughter, a show of chilling, of chilled death feeling, and flagrations, electrocutions, mutilations, live at the fridge. Daily, daily competitions, held at the fridge, no signups necessary, come for the blood and stay for the, that, I don't know what that last, that last one is. Do I have a better relic than this, or? Maybe chance, maybe the lifetime, you know what? I'd rather have the fight for your lifetime. I don't know, this might actually be better than my legendary rocket. I've been following Jack's orders from the beginning. Jack modified the power core you found to have a Hyperion network uplink. Through it, I was able to access Sanctuary's defenses and lower. It was all part of Jack's plan. I'm starting to feel like Jack is the villain in all this. Lab rat. Oh my god, wait, so are these guys mutated humans? I guess these guys are like lab abominations then. Let me test these two rocket launches. I'm i I'm thinking this blue one is actually better now. Yeah it is, okay. Alright. I'm kind of under leveled now. These guys are level 16 and I'm level 13. And there's racks. Oh, I didn't realize there was open above here. Man, Borderlands has such cool level design. What's so weird is that, like, so Angel, 
the lady that keeps talking to you. Can I switch weapons? Here we go. Oh, that was really close. <laughs> I got scared for a second. Um. Oh shit, there's a badass rack. That would explain why I keep going down so quick. Kill this. There we go. Anyways, you don't see Handsome Jack at all in the first game. You just see Angel. And now all of a sudden it turns out that there is this... Oh shit. Um... Turns out that there's Handsome Jack behind all this. Five years ago, I tricked Roland and his friends into opening the vault. I this is what I was just talking about. Jack knew he could make a fortune off the iridium held within the vault, but he was too much of a coward to open it himself. Through me, he got the vault hunters to do his dirty work. I'm so tired of the people. Wait. So we made Jack rich in the first game. God damn it. You really do create your own villains, don't you? Monsters, I think it is. There's some quote that goes like that. You create your own monsters. Oh my god, what are those things? Oh shit. The weak spots on these is the same weak spots that's on the crystals on the ground. It's interesting. Oh, I'm gonna need to kill both of these. Damn, these things are actually pretty hard to kill. I'm I'm stupid for attacking one of these. I should not have done that, but now I want the money, so we're invested in this. Oh my god, and there's another one. Jesus Christ. Not a good idea. Okay, this rocket launcher does a really good job against them. And I can buy more rockets with all this money, so... Wait. This isn't even that much. It was like a thousand. It was like five hundred. I got scammed. I don't know if it's just Axton, but I am like running through this three levels above, and it's super easy. It's such a contrast because I was having such an issue with Borderlands 1. Like it's actually difficult. It was actually really difficult at certain parts. Without you, Pandora has no hope. You have no reason to trust me. I get that. But if you're going to stop Jack from controlling the warrior, you'll need my help. Because I know where the key is. It's with me. This is a redemption arc if I've ever seen one. So...
get your health and shields right here. It's a fine day, full of opportunity. Two words, my friend. Oh, I love buying ammo in this game after uh, the mess that was Borderlands 1. Invisible assholes. <laughs> okay. Whoa, holy shit. What the fuck? You can use any fast travel station to get back to the Crimson Raiders. I'll mark the nearest one on your echo device. Error. Location? Sanctuary. Not found. Oh no. The phase blast must have taken Sanctuary off the fast travel network. Um, okay. Head to the Iridium extraction plant nearby. I think I know how to get you back to your friends. You know, I didn't lie to you about everything. You really are the only person who can stop Jack. Roland, Lilith, and Mordecai. He defeated them long ago. Meet my they can lady help you friend. reach him, but in the end, you are the fool who brings Jack down. Let's be clear here, it's not me, it's the guns. These guys really are invisible assholes. Another sentry kill. Now we got flying assholes in this too. God damn it! It's a mess. Oh, and we got loaders. What the hell? Holy shit. Tossing grenade. Oh my god, the explosions from this do so much damage. Damage and reload speed. This is overpowered. If you can cross the river and steal a supply beacon. We can get Sanctuary back onto the fast travel network. I promise. Little as I'm sure that means right now. Hey! All Hyperion robots. Yeah, the worst. All supply drops along the treasure attack will be taken out of I'm the worst, apparently. Okay. Now I just need the perk that gives me more gun damage when my sentry's out. Oh my god, that would be so good. to level up more though.
That's a great line. Whoa, there's stuff falling off Sanctuary. Oh, holy shit. What the fuck? See if we can deal with this with lots of grenades. Do you see those lunar supply shots? You need to steal a lunar supply Hell yeah. That was actually way too easy. How is this so easy when I'm under leveled? Suicide mode? Jesus Christ. That's the beacon. Um Meet my lady friend. Are you kidding me? Did that thresher just eat? Yeah, yeah, it did. When am I going to unlock this fourth ammo slot? I could use this, uh... Break the shield. Holy shit. It just healed back its shield and killed me in a single shot. Well, that's unfortunate. My god. I imagine a one life to live run in this game would be brutal. Dying is awesome. All of the cool kids are doing it. Are they? Wait, where's the thresher? Oh, there it is. Maybe I can let the robots kill it. Wait, why is it healing up to full shields? Oh my god, it heals shields really quickly. Why is it healing up its shield so quick? Holy fuck. I'm dead. What the hell killed me there? This is actually harder than the other boss fights. There we go. Hopefully I get the third weapon slot at level 15. Shivers. Ugh. Oh, this is so frustrating. You see, this is what I don't get about you bad guys. You know the hero's gonna win, but you just don't die quickly. 
Man, uh, example, this one guy in New Haven, right? City's burning, people are dying left and right, yada, yada, yada. This jackal rushes me with a spoon. <laughs> a freaking spoon, and I'm like dying laughing, right? So I scoop out his stupid little eyeballs with it, and his kids are all where? And I'm like, I can't. Holy oh, fuck, it. Jack. He can't see where he's going, he's bumping into stuff, and I. Anyway, I don't know, maybe you had to be there. The moral is. <laughs> maybe I did have to be there. Holy shit, though. That's like. This guy's getting eviler and eviler. Where am I trying to go? Over here, Flight Knight's Flying City. Oh, all the way over here. Okay, that was good driving. I got where I wanted to be. That's all that's important. You found Overlook, huh? Used to be a nice little town until Hyperion took over. Now everybody there has got the skull shivers thanks to Jack's mining operations. Poor bastards are too sick to leave their homes. You'll want to set up the beacon over there. Once the moon base processes our request, you should have a fast travel station. Welcome to Overlook. We're so pleased to see you. I've always got new stock. Check back later. Is there... is there anywhere to heal here? Oh my god. Oh, right here. Oh my god, wait. It's out of power, what the hell? Oh no. This is gonna be bad. It's transmitting the supply request now. We've just gotta wait a few minutes and Angel Just a few enough. minutes. Stop pretending to help the bad guys now. Angel We don't have long until Jack realizes I'm not helping him anymore. Defend that beacon. Now if you can't even handle these loaders, you're really gonna disappoint. It's a good thing this sniper I have destroys robots. I gotta remember that corrosive is the key. Oh, there's ammo right here, so technically I could probably just lob a whole bunch of grenades, right? Uncalibrated fast travel station request received. Estimated processing time. Alright, I gotta ignore the explosive ones because they don't do damage to me. Thank you. 
I need to find a good spot for like sniping and where I can't get hit. Oh god, I had enough trouble. Actually, that constructor before was really easy. I just used the corrosive gun, didn't I? Alright, let's repeat that. Wait, what the... Just if I go down here, I can get a revive. This is easy as long as you can get the crit spot. Hello. Easy. Alright, gotta get more grenades. I wish I could get these robots close I together. Off the moon base's oxygen supply. I expect the engineers will launch your fast travel station very soon. God damn it, Angel! What are you doing? Those are the bad guys! I'm saving everything I have in you! Oh, that was so close. I just almost got knocked off. Oh, fuck, a badass loader. This is a good use for the rocket launcher. That's true. As a person who literally only shoots things, that's true. The fast travel has landed. Give me a second while I calibrate Holy shit. New position. That was really intense. I fear you. Fast travel. Go quickly. Use the fast travel station and get back to Ooh. I wonder if robots would have just kept coming there. Okay. Wait. I'm gonna get the skull shivers at this rate. I'm sorry. Wait, what the hell? Holy shit. Hey, if you're not doing nothing, could you do some help with this? Hey, feel like solving a murder? I'm the marshal around these parts. Uh, one of these gutter quadruplets pulled the trigger on that boy over there. Consider yourself deputized. Uh, ask around in Moxie and Zans, figure out which one of these identical scum stains pulled the trigger. Otherwise, I'll just have to hang them all in. I don't got that kind of time. Uh, I heard a gunshot a couple of hours back. Naturally, I ignored it until someone came. <laughs> Naturally, I ignored it. I found this boy bleeding on the concrete, a uh, single bullet in his throat, and, and I saw one of these gutter boys running away. And that's all I know right now, more is the pity. Alright, if you say so. Yeah, I did it! I ain't sorry! Why don't- Man, good job, deputy. Marlow thought he could snipe an innocent man and get away with it. But that... 
was alone. <laughs> oh god. Some of the quests in this game. I got a good gun though. What new quest is down here? I've got an opportunity for you. Jack blasted my personal safe out of my own store. My most precious treasure could be in the hands of some freeloading bandits by now. Head back to that city side hole in the ground and get my safe back. Maybe, Marcus, if you ask nicely. Get your health and shields right here. Oh yeah, and I can equip the better shield now. Wait, still not level 15? Ah, I'm just below level 15. Why am I getting quests? I'm supposed to go back to my friends. Friends! Go see them. Oh shit, Private Jessup's here now. I'm very sorry to say, I need your assistance. Bin journals. Oh, I wonder if that's going to be like the echoes from Borderlands 1 and have some lore in it. The city may be safe right now, but what happens if Hyperion launches another barrage? We've got no shield. Ah, uh, good point. Let me get on the echo. Oh, good. You're not dead. That's his way of saying, wow, you're a badass. I'm glad you're okay. You've linked back up the Sanctuary, but you and the other members of the Resistance still have no plan, no leverage, and no obvious way of stopping Handsome Jack. Hey, it's all uphill from here, right? Wasn't so challenging. Right. Sorry. We'd all be dead if it weren't for you. But we need a plan. Jack's getting closer and closer to digging up the warrior, and we still don't know where he's got the vault key stashed. I can help you with that. You? Damn it! We told you never to contact us again! Will you please just hear me out? Sure, let's listen to the crazy computer that just tried to kill us. Hey, remember that time she told us the vault was full of loot? It's with me. I'm charging the vault key. Continue. The key naturally charges itself once every 200 years. Jack is patient, but he's not that patient. He's been using my power to forcibly charge the key with iridium. If you find me, you find the vault key. The Vault Key is housed in my AI control core, a top thousand cuts. It's protected by three impassable security hurdles. The first is a competitor deterrence field that will obliterate any non-Hyperion entity passing through it. Competitor deterrence field? What, like a death wall? It is a field of pure thermosonic energy programmed to atomize any unauthorized personnel. So yeah, a death wall. Beyond that lies the second hurdle, a defense bunker outfitted with the most high-tech weaponry Hyperion can afford. That doesn't sound good. Past the bunker, you'll have to get through the final hurdle, a door that will only open for Handsome Jack. Well, that sounds even worse. This will be your only opportunity to steal the vault key and stop Jack from controlling the warrior. I'm out of time. Do what you will, but promise me this. No matter what happens, do not allow Lilith into my chambers. What the hell's that supposed to mean? If she was luring us into a trap, she would have made it sound a little bit possible. If we're taking that bitch down, I'm coming! Trap or not! If, if anyone's gonna shut her down, it has to be you, soldier. Head to the Hyperion Preserve. I think I know how to get past the first hurdle. Alright. Wildlife Exploitation Preserve. Everybody good? Wait, so it's not like a preserve for preserving them, it's like a preserve for exploiting them? Jesus Christ. Whoa. I go up here and look. I want to look off the edge of the city. Oh, you can't you go down here. That's so cool.
Claptrap have any new quests? <laughs> birthday. It's my birthday! I first rolled off the assembly line seven years ago! Do me a favor and hand out these invites for my stellar birthday bash, will ya? And quickly, we're gonna start any minute! Let me know when you're done with that job! Wait, he didn't invite Zed? Looking for work? Oh, that's an old quest. I'm hungry. Ha! is having a shindig? You know I'd go, but I ain't gonna. <laughs> I'd go, but I ain't gonna. Come on, Scooter. Bald hole, cold shoulder, medicine man, overlook needs a hero. Can do that one. I think Roland wanted you to go check out the town of Overlook, see if you can help the people there or whatever. Them folks have been cooped up in their houses ever since they got the shivers. Dollars to donuts, they could use your help. Dollars to donuts. So cool that this is a flying city. In the clouds. Resist. I think this quest is timed. Oh, sorry, I can't make it. Give Claptrap my love, though. My purely platonic love. Things need to be shot and by Joe. Really platonic. The crystalisks weren't always brutal. I gotta remember, I'm gonna be doing like three playthroughs of this to get to Ultimate Vault Hunter, so. Could hold off on some quests. Invite next, Marcus. Marcus, yep. Flat trap, is this really who you consider your friends? <laughs> no. It's time to start the party. I saw that coming. <laughs> Going to your birthday party is a job. Super hard to find. No free to mingle with um, nobody. I remember there used to be a bug getting out of here. Oh, right. I don't have one. Menu. 
Didn't realize you don't have lungs. God damn it. Yay! Oh no. Hey, Claptrap, I brought my wife. Yeah. Blow into party favor. Oh my god. See what your other parties look like. Welcome to Sanctuary. I hear he has a problem. Probably. Alright, I'm gonna go get Overlook some medicine first. Oh, yes, and I got leveled up so I can equip a third weapon now. Go to Overlook. Oh, I forgot about these. This is actually really good for power leveling. I should probably do that. Instead of doing the side quests. It's a lot quicker. I'm going to go do that. I should probably go for I think there's another place besides Tundra, Ex Tundra Express to get the higher level mobs. I think it's Caustic Caverns. But I actually don't remember how to get to Caustic Caverns. Hmm. Anyways, these should be still be low enough level, or high enough level to get XP from. Oh god! I didn't realize that would do damage to me too. That was close. That was very stupid of me. How did that rocket miss? Oh man, this is such good XP. I'm just gonna keep doing this. I think I'm gonna get to like level 20, maybe? High enough that I can just run through the rest of everything. Let me know if anything catches your eye. A pleasure as always. Two words, my friend. No problem. 
I should probably go to the other bar kids over there too instead of restarting. I'll unequip this sniper since it doesn't do good damage to them. I guess I'll use that pistol instead. Okay, so I need a gun that doesn't kill them. Like that. Here we go. Damn, I really need this rocket launcher to take these out. Are there any of my normal guns that can actually do decent damage to this? I don't really think so. Even the grenade doesn't do that, that good damage. Eh, yeah, grenade does okay damage. Oh man, even even meleeing does enough damage. Come on, get in your cocoon. Are you kidding me? It's got like 5 HP. And it's not getting in a cocoon. Come on. heck is it doing? Stupid AI. I wonder how to get in here. Ooh, already almost got a level. Holy shit, there's actually a train going through there. Alright, I need a gun. Oh, I guess some of them do just go in pods on their own. Ooh, I'm lucky. I'm so close to a level. I 
wonder how long it'll take me to get like uh I don't know, level 20 doing this. I gotta find out some way to speed them up getting them in pods. Here we go. Alright, one level in like five minutes. That's not bad. I'm gonna raise next. Maybe the shield recharge. Number of sh shots is also really good. Hmm. Defensiveness or offensiveness? I'm thinking defense. Try to make as many as I can. Whoa, was that all of them? That was really good XP and really fast. Go into your pod form. Here we go. I'm loving Axton. He's actually overpowered. Oh no. Oh, yes. That was close. I could have died there if it went down and I didn't get the fight for your life. better gun now too, don't I?
I guess that's actually level 17. Oops. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep doing this till I'm like level 20. And then I can just plow through the story missions again. I need them to go into their pod form. Here we go. Only one of them? Come on. There we go. Let's get to killing, sweetheart. Oh, I accidentally Thank blew up you. that other pod. Oh yeah, this is going to be good. We got it coming. Tossing the little lady. I'm ready for more. I just need to get my turret down and then I stop dying as much. I stop going down. Wait, I think there's one more, isn't there? I guess not. I swear one of them like flew away or something, I don't know. Do they ever just go into pods without you shooting them? Like, do I not need to shoot them for them to transform? I think I do, they aren't transforming. Oh yeah, so that one I didn't shoot and it transformed. I don't understand it. So basically I'm just repeating this farming these mutants for XP until I'm like level 20 and then I'll be higher level in the story mission. And then I can just run through the story really quickly. I'm going to try to get them turning into pods this time without shooting them. Let me see, if I just stand here... Oh yeah, if I just stand here they just turn into pods. Awesome. Still seems like I didn't get as many turned.
<laughs> I just blew myself up and then revived myself right away. This game. There's not a lot of games like it. And I'm just about to get a level too. I'm gonna try switching switching it up. Maybe just going straight there to here because there's not actually that many over there. Oh yeah. We're gonna get a bunch of mutants this time. Got way too many mutants. I gotta wait for one of these to land, or I can't see anything, Jesus Christ. <laughs> this rocket launcher is so good. Ah, oh, so they're down to 1300 XP now. Oh, and I accidentally picked up all of them. I'm an idiot. Well, that was still two levels, so that's pretty good. Yeah, so once you hand in the quest, you can't farm them anymore. So that... that was kind of stupid of me, but whatever. It's just the first run, so... Doesn't really matter. Finish that job yet? Oh, wrong person. Oops. Just leaving Justin on the ground there, damn. Sir Hammerlock realized that nature isn't always beautiful, which would have which would have been kind of poignant had his immediate reaction not been, oh god, kill all of them, ooh ooh ooh. I realize that you all are just so meant to respect all of nature's creatures, but come on, the bugger looked like a pus-filled scab with wings. Is Balter is loot? Oh, what's this? This is a message to any Crimson Lance left on Pandora. General Knox is dead, and knowing the Lance, they'll more likely cut their losses and leave you here than send an extraction ship. So unless you want to starve to death out there, you got two options. One, you become bandits. Two, you join me in protecting the people of Sanctuary. I can offer you food, shelter, and the chance to fight for something real, something meaningful. A chance I know the Atlas Corporation never gave you. Roland, out. That's some real stuff. I wonder if I'll go and do this quest too, just to get some extra XP. Because this is level 19, I'm still not going to be high enough. Maybe I should also do that. I'll go do some quests and overlook, I think.
arm stealing. Stalkers don't like it when people hunt them. You don't say. you dispatch those r robots we of the town of overlook thought you might give us a hand so to speak so first item on the agenda we're all dying of a brain disease C could get us three shipments of medication we would live which uh, would allow me to keep paying you our m medicine machine needs a new battery please climb the clock tower ladder and remove the clock's battery Attack. Okay, I can do that. Easy fetch quest. Warning, do not touch Dave. God damn it, some jackhole broke the clock tower! How the hell am I supposed to know what time it is now? You found the battery. Plug it into our medicine machine and buy some skull shiver medication. Please. Once I find out who thought we needed a running clock more badly than we needed shiver medication, they will be thoroughly reprimanded. Dave. Almost dead. Thank you, but we need two more medicine shipments. The next is carried by a traveling Hyperion requisition officer wandering the highlands. Get the medicine from him. Without his guards, I'm sure the salesman will give you a good price for his medicine. I suggest killing them politely, if possible. Killing politely. Okay. Sure. Oh, okay, it's over there. I'm late, that scooter spent fresh. Yeah, I'll catch a real. Oh, man, I just realized that's so Oh my god, and a thresher. The hell, that guy is jumping around with the uh, medicine on his back. That must be a strong power suit. Oh, fuck a thresher. Oh, I was doing so well. <laughs> and then I fell off. Where's this one? Oh, over here. Oh, it's right here. Be careful. 
I am. Uh, I can't see anything. Holy shit. Why is my screen all dark? What the fuck? do anything if I can't see. Also, your screen goes black when you die. I actually thought I died there for a second. Scorching bitches. I love Scooter. residents now have enough skull shiver medication to keep them from stuttering and or blacking out and or dying for the rest of the year. Like you, this town would be running like clockwork. Overlook needs a shield. Now that our brains aren't going to rot from the inside, let's move on to point two on my agenda. Revolt. If we are to shake off Hyperion control, the town will need a shield like sanctuaries to protect it from moonshot blitzes. If you could donate some shields to the town, I could scavenge them and build us a shield. Watch out for those fuckers. Attack! Alright, that should be easy. I should just be able to buy. My weapon machines will fix that for you. Oh, I gotta use these customization things. I should just be able to buy shields for this, right? Switch my weapons around. I think I got a better sniper now. Oh man, it might actually be worse. I'm not sure. I'll have to test it out. This is definitely better. I'm still using this level 8. Let's go. Alright, drop shields into grinder. The cheapest shield I can buy. One, two, three, four. I don't have enough money. How don't I have enough money? Wait, where can I buy lower level shields? Apparently it's not easy to just drop them. Maybe I can do it from here? No. No, oh, fuck! Oh my god. Why is it dropping it forward instead of down where I'm looking? Holy shit! Oh my god, it, are you fucking kidding me? Drop. Oh my god, that was way too hard. I'm gonna go to like a level one area and see if I can buy shields there. Liarsburg should do. 
Wait, can I even go to Liar's Burn? Hyperion is proud to announce the size of your bi yearly medicine Southern shipment. Shell. Congratulations. Oh, it's Southern Shelf, not Liar's Burn. <laughs> Can I get cheap shields here? I'm legally obligated to tell you yeah, I can. All right, awesome. Just drop whatever shields you no longer want into the grinder. Oh, and one still missed. I never thought it would be so hard just to drop items in a hole. Safe. Overlook shield is finished, and I would very much like your help testing it. Head to the Hyperion outpost near by and get to the mortar cannon on the launch pad. Hey, Karina. You know what's even better than having a working shield? Not being a woman. <laughs> oh my god, shut up, Dave. <laughs> my weapon machines will fix that for you. See you soon. Yeah, I think that's better. Alright, head to Hyperion Mortar. This is only a test. I wonder if I should do the other side quests there too, like arms dealing, to get that extra XP. Actually, I probably could have taken the Thresher quest or the Stalker quest when we killed them in vehicles. It's kind of too late now, but while I was driving around before, oh my god. Now there's Threshers behind me too? Jesus Christ. Wait, what the hell? Why didn't that revive me? Oh my god, that... ripped me out. my first time really playing Axton so I don't I don't know if I'm supposed to be using this turret differently but right now it's just I'm building it completely damaged I gotta stop using this level 8 gun there's like no damage now this sniper destroys though especially against the loaders oh shit I'm going down here When I'm going down, I like to go and stand out in the open so that I can get a kill if 
as easy as possible to get back up. It seems so weird though to just run out in the open as soon as you're about to like go down. Most other games you try and like duck and cover and heal. Borderlands is in most games though. Oh, I just pressed the wrong button. I'm an idiot. Oh, God. <laughs> I just threw grenades everywhere and died. Oh. That wasn't very smart. Not very smart at all. since the Hyperion just killed me then. Where am I getting shot from up there? I just saw some bullets fly through there. <laughs> now, let's try that with the shield on. <laughs> oh my god. Please fire the cannon again. Happy day! Oh, that's so good. Feels so good having no fall damage. Borderlands 1, I started getting scared every time I jumped off a cliff. Looking at this though, this is so much worse XP than the mutant farming that I was doing. So, I really should have kept that quest and not messed it up, but it happens. I'm probably just going to head on with the main quest after this. Overlook is safe except for that guy who died. You know my favorite thing about Dave? He's dead. <laughs> uh, that's my favorite thing too. 
What do you mean, theoretically? I don't know if I want to use this deadly bloom, maybe. Any other quests I want to do here? And uh, I'm just going to go straight to the main story. Go to the Wildlife Exploitation Preserve. Oh, the same area. Isotope Reclamation Tower. Sounds futuristic and sciencey. Man, this game is beautiful. Wildlife Exploitation Preserve. Instead of wildlife preserve to get through that Hyperion force field. Now he's out of date though. You'll need a software upgrade. Mordecai should have what you need. He's camped down near the preserve. Think he needs your help with something. It's a fine day. Full of opportunity. Come back anytime. Let's go preserve some animals. I can't see the animals. That's a nice sniping spot, Mordecai. Casa de Mordecai. I heard about Sanctuary. You all right? Sorry, I missed the action. I saw some Hyperion movement out in Tundra Express, so Bloodwing and I checked it out. Didn't realize we were walking into a trap. Bloodwing gave me time to get away. Bastards grabbed her. Brought her here. Those bastards. Like the loader count there. Rolling echo to head. All my data's on a chip in my bird bloodwings collar, including your claptrap upgrade. Some Hyperion jackasses nabbed her, took her into the preserve over there. I'm glad you're here. I've been scouting the place for the last half hour. It looks like at least a two-man job. You can get inside through the shipyard. I can give you support and lead you to Bloodwing. Get my bird, get your claptrap upgrade. What is this thing? Oh my god, he's roasting a stalker head. Actually, you know what, I guess I can just jump straight off here. Wee. Jack makes me laugh. He kidnapped blood wings, so I start pissing my pants and making threats that if anything happens to my bird, I'll blah blah blah. But Blood and I have been through a lot. I know my girl can handle herself. <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> 
Unauthorized access detected. Releasing loader. Oh shit, an ambush. They're behind me. Does crippling count as shooting off their arms? There we go. That is what it means. Oh, fuck. This one reflects bullets. How do I even take this guy out? Oh no, I got myself in a corner. There we go. Oh, shit. I don't know what I'm going to do without my sniper. It's like the only gun that does decent damage right now. Oh wait, I guess I still have my rocket launcher and grenades. I love the noise these guys make. Blah. Now I got more sniper ammo too. Awesome. And I'm just about level 18. Alright, this is all good. Rocket launcher. I'm gonna take this guy out. I feel like this is too easy, even for low level stuff. Can I equip this now? Yeah, I can. Alright. Oh god, what was that? I must have stood by an explosive barrel or something. Welcome to the wildlife exploitation preserve. Jack says he built this place to promote science and discovery. Well, uh, but it's BS. They're just using slag to experiment on every creature they can find. Gotta get Bugwing out of there. Oh god, foreshadowing. This rocket launcher has saved me so many times now. I need to find a better one though, it's almost under leveled. I'm under leveled though, I guess that's the major issue. No problem. Science. 
science that flies in the face of human ethics. Needless to say, I'm extremely interested in it. Samples of the slab serum hypothesis of the wildlife. Of course you are, Tannis. Of course you are. I still remember she betrayed us in Borderlands 1. I'm not trusting anything she says. Badass. Kill it for the XP. Oh yeah, if I can lure them in this hallway, then I can just shoot straight down it. Oh, but there's ammo here. Kill him with fire. Welcome to my humble shop. Caveat Emptor. Thanks for the scratch. Caveat Emptor. Remember, we're all welcome to Dr. Zed's portable clinic. What can I get for you? Stay alive. Uh, I'm one level under leveled still here. I really gotta just go and do side quests at one point. I wonder if I took the quest to kill stalkers, if it would have counted killing the stalkers here. I think it would have. I hate these power loaders, they're actually difficult to kill. Ooh, and lets my turret distract so then I can shoot them in the back. Are these guys just going to keep spawning as I kill them, or...? Holy shit, that went straight through me. I just want to go through this door. Just let me through. Oh shit, that's a badass stalker. Crap, I got stuck on these crates. I think I can get a revive on this guy, yeah. Okay. Hey, Hello, me. 
Oh no, I'm down again. Shit. Unless my turret can get a kill here, I'm... Going down. Oh, actually, maybe. Yeah! This rocket launcher actually saved my life, like, ten times now. Bloodwing. Domesticated, extremely dangerous. Did you find her? Is she okay? Looking for Bloodwing? Oh, I moved her a few hours ago. Somewhere a little more dramatic. Lord, we ain't there? Damn it! Jack's playing games with us. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm seeing some commotion in the observation wing. Maybe they moved it there. Just, just keep pushing through the preserve, amigo. And they just opened all of the holding cells. Oh god. And I have no grenades. Holy shit. Run. Run! basically just kills stuff with it. That's not a lot. Still don't have any grenades. Maybe I can just blow all these guys up. Here we go. Still no grenades. See if we can get some grenades here. This guy has no legs. Thank you for opening close volunteering closed close as a test subject at Hyperion Preserve. Do not attempt to leave the ground. Thank you for applying as a test subject? Oh god. What does this button do? Attention, open close volunteers, close close. Following your experience. Doesn't do anything. Oh god, that's evil. Okay, I got one grenade. Two grenade, three grenade, four grenade. That's that's good enough. It's enough that if I get in trouble I can just chuck them and run.
Blah. These death noises are like so over the top, it's awesome. This game is awesome. Nearly paid off the house. That's that's the real sad one. I hope there's somewhere to get ammo before I go and fight the boss, otherwise I'm gonna run out of ammo in the boss fight. Yeah, there's no ammo spots here. Oh god, this is gonna be bad. I'm just going straight in then if there's no ammo here. Fucking evil man. Yeah, preservation. Just give it up, kiddo. Bloodwing's got all the elements at her disposal. Fire, electricity, corrosion, slag. Hopefully, I can collect some ammo here. Ah, damn, I forgot the last one. What the hell was that again? God damn it! Just, just weaken her, and I'll hit her with a drink. I'm sorry, soldier, but you gotta beat Bloodwing down. Do what you can to save her, but if you can't, she's done what we need to get into Control Core Angel and grab the Vault Key. That's what matters here. I literally haven't done damage yet. Oh, was I not able to do damage until then? That, that explains it. Fucking Zed, it's gonna make a zombie. I would not trust Zed. Sniper is really good. Sniper is good, but I'm not. Can I throw the grenade straight up like that? No, it deploys too late. Wait, what the hell killed me? Oh, I guess corrosive? I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill this before. Yeah, and it didn't it didn't give me fight for my life either, so I'm going down. God damn it. So I got the kill but it didn't revive me. That's fucking stupid. Oh, poor Bloodwing. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Turn yourselves in, or 
that dumbass bird is just the beginning. God damn it, Jack! This guy's I fucking evil. You know. you hear me? <laughs> I'm sorry about Bloodwing, soldier, but we gotta keep moving. Get that software upgrade to Claptrap, and we'll be able to get through the security field leading to no, the control core. Bloodwing. Poor Bloodwing. But guns! We got guns! We didn't even get good guns. Alright, deliver upgrade. Upgrade to Claptrap. Still kind of under leveled, aren't we? And yeah, we're almost level 19. Sweet, sweet. Found it. All right, this is a song for Mordecai's stupid bird. <clears throat> Any. Besides, they're killing me. <laughs> Are you a screw you? It would have been hilarious if I found it earlier. Shut up! Jack sucks at playing violin, but that's not surprising. You guy's asking the real questions. Which one you said that? <laughs> you can actually give him a high five, that's great. How are we gonna get past this bunker? Oh shit. Ludwig. Damn. Yeah. I have something remember there. Remember that time Mordecai got shot in the shoulder and he just hid behind cover and threw Bloodwing out to face those bandits on his own? Yeah, I did. That was me in Borderlands One. Yeah. I played Mordecai. Ludwig just flew around and around in circles, not attacking anybody. Mordecai was screaming at him, What are you doing, you coward? Get to kill him! Blah, blah, blah. And finally, Mordecai stood up out and of cover. And Bloodwing went screaming down into the fray and killed all those bandits in a half second. Yeah, he wanted Mordecai to see him do it. Wanted to make him proud. And Mordecai was happy as a skag and slag, kissing his beak, scratching his neck. Yeah, which would have been cute if Bloodwing hadn't been covered in entrails. <laughs> Shut up already! I don't think this was in the game before. Uh, I'm a bad person. I don't remember that. I don't remember that conversation from before. Oh my god. Oh, poor Mordecai. Cost was high, but you successfully secured a way past the first obstacle to control Core Angel. Sorry about Bloodwing, soldier. But there's still more to be done if we're going to reach Angel and get the vault key. Take this note to Thousand Cuts. Deliver this note to the Slab King. I owe you one world saved. You're going to deliver that note to a bandit leader known as the Slab King. Now, he used to be a part of the Crimson Raiders until his methods got too brutal. I didn't think ripping Hyperion officials limb from limb in front of their loved ones was an effective way to get into them. He disagreed. Still, he owes me a favor. And he can help us get past the bunker outside Control Core Angel. What about you? You got any quests? You. No, you actually don't have any new quests. Time to train.
I don't know if I want to uh, use any of these. Oh, that sniper might be good. Also, I don't know if I want to go do some side quests. Level 20, I'm level 19. Yeah, I think I'm actually good enough to do it. But, I'm going to go to lunch. That'll be the end of this morning stream. Thanks to anyone who stopped by and watched Borderlands this morning. I love this game. Uh, I'm also liking playing it in the morning. Uh, instead of doing uh, programming. I think I'm going to keep doing this and warming up with playing some games. But it seems to work really well. I'm going to go and I'm going to eat lunch and then probably going to do a good programming stream this afternoon. So if you're interested in that, watch for that. Otherwise, uh, you can join the Discord, talk about stuff there. Uh, I'm now uploading all the live streams to YouTube, so there's a link to that in the description as well. But yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, follow me if you want to watch more Borderlands, because I'm going to be playing through all of the Borderlands games, coming up to the new Borderlands 3. Everyone have a good day. I will see you later.